All right, we're back with the Sega. Fuck <laughs> it, I did it again. <laughs> the ni- we're back with the Super Nintendo Sega. <laughs> the Super Nintendo Sega, yeah, the ultimate video game. Let's go. I have beaten all of the Mega Man X games now, except for Command Mission. So this is going to be like revisiting an old friend oh, for me. When you do Command Mission, let me know. That was like my first and favorite Mega Man game. I do again. I really need to find a copy of it. I don't know where to get it. Because it's not in the uh, X Legacy Collection, so yeah. I had it on GameCube back in the day. Oh, sick. That's so cool. <laughs> I had it. My main GameCube games was Wind Waker, uh, Command Mission, and Pokemon Coliseum. Mmm. Mmm. Good combo. Good combo of games there. Yeah, uh, you know what? Hot take. Mega Man X absolutely shits on OG Mega Man. It is the best Mega Man media, I think. I, uh, and do you know what? I, it's not perfect. There are some Mega Man X games that are bullshit hard, like unnecessarily hard, and some bosses are just not fucking fun. But that's like further on in. Earlier on, like Mega Man X is peak gaming. This is unreally good. I remember the first time I played this when I got this uh, mini console. Mm. I uh, I sucked. <laughs> oh, okay. Fair enough. Being as I'd never played a proper Mega Man game before. And I'm no good at side-scrolling games. I was like, okay, let's play Mega Man X. Because I saw Egoraptor's video on it. I was like, this shouldn't be too difficult. I was like, oh no. Oh, it's hard. Oh, it's a hard game. Yeah, it's mainly if you don't do the uh, Mavericks in the right order, you're going to get shit kicked in. Yeah. Like, you have to play the way you're supposed to play. Like Mega Man. But if you're super skilled, you can then go in and beat the whole game with the Mega Buster. And at that point, I think you're a fucking freak. <laughs> you are a fucking freak if you can do that. Also, this is way more intro than I remember there being. Um... I'm just gonna... There we go. That'll do. We know Mega Man's story. This is like a hundred years after the original Mega Man. It's in the future. There yeah, are reploids. His, his family was travelling and then there was a ship crash and then the mothers had to... Mother and father made a, a tree house and then a giant leopard <laughs> attacks the parents and kills them. Exactly, yeah, yeah. Or is that Tarzan? No, that's definitely Mega Man. <laughs> Megazan. <laughs> there we are. Because uh, you can wall climb in this, can't you? Like, <laughs> like Tarzan. <laughs> I know, do you remember that theme song? Super fighting robot Mega Man. Two worlds, one family. <laughs> Phil Collins is spinning in his grave. He's not dead! Yeah, he's, that's why he's spinning. He's trying to get out. He's like, mate, I'm not Help! dead yet. I've been buried alive. Oh, my God. Fucking fuck off, you lot. Go away. There we go. God, I'm playing like such a fucking scrub right now. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm oh, he just drove him off the cliff. He did. <laughs> fucking jokes on him. No! <laughs> Why am I like significantly worse at video games when I'm playing them for the internet? What is that about? Why is that the case? Because you know you're actually shit and you've just been lying. No, I've beaten every single Mega Man game. I beat that one boss from X5 that was fucking obnoxiously hard and I did it without a guide. But. <laughs> And then you throw the intro level of the first game at me and I'm like, Duh, how does I game? How does I do a game? I can't do it, too many enemies. Ah, there we go. There's our fucking boy. There's Vile. Have you watched uh, Day of Sigma before? I need to do the video games on it at some point. Even though it's technically not, a, not like a TV show, it's more of a standalone animation. But have you seen it before? No, I have not. It's fucking great. Even if you don't, like, follow Mega Man X, it's still fun to watch. It is the prequel animation to the whole series. Oh. So it explains how all of this shit happened, like how Sigma turned evil and all of it. <laughs> Spoiler, Dr. fucking Wily. Of course it was. I mean, is he really evil Sigma, though? Yeah. Like, undoubtedly, super genocidal of humanity. So it's not like a programming thing where he's been turned evil and he's not oh. aware he's being evil. Uh, oh, mm. He's a good person who was corrupted that badly by Wily that it's irreversible. He's irreversibly evil afterwards. So yeah, so it's not his choice. He's been reprogrammed. So he thinks. Does he know he's doing wrong, or does he think he's in the right? But I think he now knows that he's doing wrong, but he relishes it. I think ah. he's like em- embraced the fact that he's b- been so thoroughly corrupted and is so evil now, and is such a pervasive e- force for destruction in the universe. So yeah. Anyway, that was our fun little Sigma psychoanalysis. Let's move on, I guess. Hey, Zero, what up? Goodbye, Zero. Goodbye, Zero. <laughs> Secret of Mana! Oh, it's a two-player, isn't it? Oh, we could play quite a bit of this. We could get a little lost in this game, I think. I've not actually played this. I've just seen playthroughs of it, and it looks really good. Um, 
That says Squaresoft TM as in trademark, but because of the pixelation, I thought it said Squaresoft. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite company, Squaresoft. <laughs> All right, let's go. Druvid. Hey, guys, wait up! I am Druvid! Yeah. Shh, be quiet. The elves will find us here and he'll be mad. Are these like my school, schoolyard chums? Yeah, we're not supposed to be here. There's a ghost around. Oh, Luke. <laughs> <laughs> you really believe that? People say that to scare us. But I heard Grandma say something about a shiny object near the falls. That must be some new kind of treasure. We have to find it. You dress like a fucking gnome. <laughs> anyway, it's, ah, it's, fuck! It's his birthday. He's, or a <laughs> it's either his birthday or he's wearing a dunce hat. <laughs> <laughs> he's either a year older or a dipshit. We can't confirm yet. But Luke can be both. <laughs> well, yeah, there you go. Why can't be both? That'd be two hats. <laughs> <laughs> I've got nowhere to get back up. Now what am I going to do? I'm going on adventures. That's what I'm going to do. We. Not that way. That is not the way. That is the incorrect direction. Down here is the way. Wow, you move fast in this game. I did not. I thought it was. A, I thought this was quite a slow moving game. Can you jump? Uh, nope. Oh, but I can fucking run. Wait, nope. What was that? Oh yeah, I can fucking boof it so quick. Oh my god, this game would be amazing for speed running. The speed you can bolt at in this. David. 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 <laughs> I'm having a stroke! <laughs> Call the paramedics! <laughs> okay, there's like a stamina function in this game where if I'm like... If I don't give myself time between swings, all my attacks turn to shit, I think. So I'm gonna give myself that second, there we go, and then... Yeah! There we go, yeah! So between each attack, I need to let it charge up a little bit before I do it again. Well taught game within a controlled environment! This is... I'm learning. Come on. Hey, 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 hey. Yay, there we go. You're getting stronger. Oh, no, it's a treasure trust. Ah, no! No, life is over. Fuck off, old lady. <laughs> no, the chest is gone. Ah, oh, video games are a fucking mistake. <laughs> All right, well. I'm sure it wasn't anything important, he says through gritted teeth. Greetings, Grandma. An unshaven beard. <laughs> Did you see that, Duvent? Something lit the sky near the falls. I have a bad feeling about this. That's probably our player too, but we'll never find out. Uh, of all the Star Fox games, this is one of the few that I haven't actually played. I've played 64. I played a little bit of Assault. I played Adventures, God help me. Um, and I even played a little bit of Command, but not this one. But I think if we beat the first level of this, it unlocks the second game on this console. Oh, really? You have to, like, beat it to unlock the other one? Yeah, it's either the first level or you beat the whole first game. If it's the... S if it's the first level, then yeah, we will play Star Fox 2. Otherwise, don't give a fuck. I've beaten Star Fox 2. Like, <laughs> it's on the uh, Switch as well. And it's fine. It's just very sure. If it plays the same way Star Fox Command for the DS does. Where you've got the world map and you have to move yourself on the world map and then you play the encounters that you run into on the map, if ah. that makes sense. So it's like a tower defense, but you then have to get in the fucking thick of it when an actual conflict happens. I fucking love General Pepper's cool ass fucking shades in this game. He's got he's got a fucking men in black drip on him. I'm OK with that. He just looks like a bit doofy in the later games. Oh, we're going to talk about eggs now, are we? Oh, you better believe it. Scramble. And I ain't yoking. Hey. Oh, that joke went over easy. Yeah, I know, right? I mean, I'm sure the viewers are cracking up right now. <laughs> Jeez, what's wrong with us? Anyway, let's go! Uh, this is the best fucking opening theme to any game ever. Let's go. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, because all your viewers are chicken embryos. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Oh, that was my bomb. Whoops, sorry. Well done. You know what? It's fine. I'm just doing a little test of my functions, you know? It's fine, you gotta do it. Do you remember when this was like the best graphics? To be fair, it's still... If you consider it like a stylized thing and ignore the pop-in, the pop-in's pretty bad, it does still look kind of cool. Like, it's got a unique look that I think I appreciate. Like, it looks retro as fuck. When, yeah, at the time, this was super fucking high-tech. <laughs> 
thing is, this is a game I'm, su I'm surprised they've not remade this. Like, they're even... I guess you could call Star Fox 64 a remake of this. Oh, oh well, well I healed done. it off. Doesn't matter, I healed it off. <laughs> I went into healing some good. <laughs> there we are. I was meant to probably break there, but I just, I, I only half paid attention to the buttons. All right, is this better than Star Fox Adventures? Yeah, I'm gonna say yeah, but Star Fox Adventures is just, if you look at it as not a Star Fox game, it's a fine adventure game. Not even a great one, just a fine one. But when you look at what Star Fox could be, it's just like, well, this is such a fucking waste of my time. <laughs> Why am I hanging out with fucking dinosaurs? What is this shit? And Star Fox Assault, I think, was actually really good. It just people, loads, loads of people slept on it, and they thought the, um... It was the controls the, they didn't like, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, but you could change the controls, is the thing. The default controls were shit, I will say. Like, the fucking, oh shit, on ground sections where you control it with one stick. What the fuck is that? But when you put on advanced controls, then the game fucking plays beautifully. It's think, so good then. Was that the one on the Wii U when you had to use the uh, the pad? Oh no, that's Star Fox Zero. I forgot about that one. That one was just garbage. <laughs> that one just sucked. Yeah. Sorry, I was the, I'm was i on about Assault, the GameCube game that everyone just kind of ignores. The one that came oh, after I Adventures. I forgot about that. I was thinking about the Wii U one. Yeah, no, Star Fox Zero does control like garbage and you can't really fix it because it tries to shoehorn the um, Wii U pad into everything and it just doesn't work. Just doesn't work at all. Ah, fuck. Oh, my Wii U, I had, um, when I got my Wii U years, a few years ago, I got it, like, the week before the Switch came out, because the price dropped, mm -hmm. and I had fuck all money, so yeah. I thought, fuck it, I'll get a Wii U instead. I got Wind Waker, and I brought a Pro Controller, because mm. I was using the, the pad yeah. to control it, and yes, it had your menus and your maps on it, it was cool to look down and have, like, the map. A bigger map there mm. but then when you try to use the the pro controller it keeps asking you even like a few minutes oh, into using break? it it asks you to check mm. if you're still okay using the pro controller ah uh, okay it's like the game discourages you from using it hmm it's like are you sure you want to use a pro <laughs> controller i promise you it's probably not gonna be good if you do <laughs> you really probably shouldn't play it like this well i paid fucking 60 quid for this controller <laughs> i'm gonna use it <laughs> no nah, you're fucking not bitch <laughs> Oh, okay. So when I got my Switch, I was like, first thing I'm buying is a Pro mm. Controller. I, I see the gimmick. Uh, fucking... What am I shooting? What exactly am I shooting? Am I shooting the floaty medillies or the little glow the sections? underneath. Yeah, I assume those things, yeah. Oh, but he just healed himself a little bit there, like, weirdly. Huh. Unless it's like each one I shoot has its own health bar, because the health bar just jumped back up, and I'm... Um, hmm. Big, big Maybe if on that it's one. spinning in front, it's protecting that particular one. Maybe. Possibly. I'm trying to gauge what it wants me to do. Oh, is it? Oh, yeah, okay, that that's one it. of them gone. That's yeah, one of them gone. That did damage. I just need to fucking play carefully because I'm low on shields. Okay, that's the second one down. What is this? What are those? Rockets. That's fine. Uh, no, you don't. You're not killing me. Oh, you're not killing me, bitch. Fuck! Ah, oh, he killed me! <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Alright, that was. This game's really good. This game, obviously, it's hard to fucking see what things are sometimes because graphics, but. You know, it's actually like. It plays well when you know what you're actually doing. Oh, well, next game! No, I want to beat Oh, I wanted to beat him! Also, we didn't get Star Fox 2! Hello, everyone. It's me, David from the future. Uh, I've stolen some footage from YouTuber and streamer Vixie Nyan, uh, showing off a little bit of a Star Fox 2 playthrough because look how fucking good this game looks. This is an SNES game. Would you believe that if I told you that? Like, look how nice this is. <laughs> it's a really decent looking game, like genuinely. Like, this holds up, actually. I don't know why this was unreleased. It is very much a well-made and complete game. Uh, obviously this is just a boss fight with Star Wolf, who, yes, did debut in this game. And, um, I think the thing that makes this game stand out compared to the rest of the series is that almost all of the combat is done in a 3D open space, like free flight and everything. All, all, all range mode, as 64 would call it. And, uh, you also get to ch turn your Arwing into a walker, 
something Star Fox Zero would rip off and do badly. And also you get two new pilots. One of them is a cute doggy and the other one is a cute lynx. They are both adorable. So, good game, well worth seeking out. Super Castlevania 4. Spiders. Now with extra spiders and bats as well. A whole menagerie of creepy animals. All right, I don't think I have played this one. Yeah, no, I just found it on a... We did it on episode 16, The Worm Master. Oh, and that was Super Castlevania 4? No, it was a different one. Ah, uh, okay. That's cool, that's cool. I'm okay with that. Yeah, I don't think I remember a drawbridge, so this is definitely new. Can I just stay at the top and then jump? Can I just jump on the roof? Have I found a secret already? Have I, did I, am I a smart boy who just found a really clever secret? If I just... And then... Yep! Oh, that would have been so cool, though! I really did. thought I was onto something there. It was Castlevania The New Generation. Okay, and it was a different game. That was that one had Richter in it, didn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Cool. All right. Let's fucking go then. Oh, does this one let me do the the crazy whip? Yeah! Oh, I can do this. <laughs> My favorite thing to do in any Castlevania. Oh, it's the one that lets you do the fun whip. Wee! <laughs> Look at that. And it blocks uh, oncoming projectiles. Yes, that was actually integrated into their uh, move set in Smash Ultimate. Even though no one fucking uses it for that, it's, it is there. You can do it. Uh, is this a go through the door? It's a go through the door dealy. Look at that. Hey, I didn't fall to my death immediately. Go me. I am going to beat the first level of a fucking video game today. I refuse to let this fucking do me in. I don't care if it is Castlevania. I've been scrubbing it up too hard today. Stop pinging me, internet. That was me in the group chat for, oh. <laughs> for Battle Spirit Saga. Oh, I see. You're letting the you're letting the group know where well, we are going to be there this evening. Yeah, yeah we, me and Dan have got big into this new, well, remade card game called Battle Spirit Saga. If you haven't played it before, play it. It's very good. Get a starter deck, find some friends who are down to learn a card game with you, and just give it a crack. It's like magic, but you can level shit up. It's great. In the future, David and I might actually start filming our matches between us. That would be fun as shit. I never even considered that, but that's a great idea, actually. Piss. Piss and biscuits, for fuck's sake! Yay! A two-player! <laughs> Finally! And you know what? This is a game where I can win! <laughs> I'm going to win, fuck you! I need to win something today! <laughs> oh my god, please! <laughs> Alright, let's go 100cc. Yep. Fuck it, I'll be Donkey Kong Jr. Everyone, everyone loves Donkey Kong Jr. He just kind of disappeared. There we go. You be Yoshi. Should we go straight to the hardest one available right now, stock up? Yeah. Oh, middle one. Okay. As far as you're aware. <laughs> well, I, I saw you pick the middle one. No, you so didn't. I did. Oh, fuck. What's the go button? I think it's B. It yeah. is. Yay. <laughs> okay. I'm going to bring this back. I've oh, got to win like a motherfucker. Okay, we've got the drift R on the R. We've got B to drive. This guy. We got coins. <laughs> Why did I get a fucking coin if I'm in seventh? I need more than a coin game. A little more would be nice. All right, it's A to use items. Oh my God, I feel like... Oh, I suck at this. <laughs> it's fine. I got this. As long as one of us has to win, it's not going to be me. <laughs> That's fine. I'm okay with that. As long as I'm beating you. All right, I'm getting a feel for this now. I'm just, except I fall off the fucking road, so now I'm super far behind. Ah! Do, 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 do. Oh, God. I don't drive fast. This somehow drives better than my car. Yeah. <laughs> your shit. Oh, God. I just mushroomed straight into fucking nothingness there. Oh, my car. I've got a new story for you. What has it done this time? Your it, fucking death trap of a vehicle. So it's... See, it makes a terrible grinding noise, as you know. Yes. Now it's getting worse. Mm -hmm. And I'm, I can actually... It's an automatic, but I've managed to make it stall in reverse. How do you stall an automatic in reverse? How do you even do that? That seems impossible. <laughs> you need gears for that, right? <laughs> yep. Somehow. Okay, well, <laughs> power to you for finding new ways to endanger <laughs> yourself in your day to day. I'm gonna just fucking. Oh my god, I'm in second. Oh, no! You, you, ooh, I'm in third! Third will do! I'll take third! That's fine by me. I'm a coming! <laughs> <laughs> You're slowly approaching! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I think the key is to not fall off the track because that makes you very slow. 
You shut up. <laughs> I won something. I'll take it. Wait, did you get kicked out completely? Yes. <laughs> you don't even get to play anymore. Does that actually happen? Is, or am I fucking hallucinating? Oh, Jesus. Uh, fuck off with your star. Yeah! <laughs> you fell down the one bit of floor that you could fall down. <laughs> Hooray! Ooh, it's just me and you. I don't give a shit about the rest of the race. I'm just trying to beat you. I'm trying to take that seventh place from you, new Yay. fucker! I <laughs> just exploded! We just explode when we lose! Well, that level was hard. <laughs> Both ranked up. That's fine. Oh, it just redo this level over or just give the fuck up. All right, you know what? I think we're done.